Thank you for choosing me. I will give you this model and the reference for free. To use it for your Preactus, link to the file on my descriptions. Welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you a simple way to make curl jump animation exercise in Blender. Then if get your hair you have your fur. So here I'm going to use this as my reference. So now I have our model. Now we are going to make animation like this. We are going to use this as our reference. Let's change the frame rate to 30. Now what are you going to do? So now select your rig and go to post mode and change from keyframe. And keyframe set to location, rotation and scale. And make sure your auto key is enabled. Then you have to use the reference. Scale down. Rotate it is this small like this. Now put this down small and select the hand. And put it down. Let's switch to local and rotate it forward. Select this one and we rotate like this. Yes. Set the upper. And rotate it. Now to make sure that the pose match your reference up there. Move it a little bit. Now you how to pull your hip bone back like that. Now pull it down small. Now press A and select everything and insert keyframe. Now let's go back to here. So now on. Frame 33 insert keyframe again. So let's end our timeline to 33. Now let's go back to frame 16. Alt plus R and reset the rotation. Alt plus R and reset rotation. Select this one and pull it from. Make sure your hip bone you don't move it on X, A, Z's. Only Y and Z as is you can move your hip bone. Select the hand and pull it from small like that. 
Now we are going to make that hand fold. what you have to the reference rotate it is small like that so for the hand you have to make sure because the hands if you don't pose it correctly you will see that it is moving like a cartoonish way so that is why I have to take time on the hands to push it very much to match the reference. You can also keep on changing the transformation orientation Sometimes it's difficult to move it there. Pause on local. Select everything and then press I and insert keyframe again. So here I'm detaining where. And where it leave the ground. So that's where you're going to insert keyframe. And push this. SO now. You see that on frame. I'll go back to frame 10, press Alt G to reset the position. Select your hair and move it up a little bit. So here I select the hand and Alt plus R and Alt plus G to reset the position and the rotation. Then now I pose it again. Select everything and insert keyframe again.
So in here select this to like and copy. Copy this keyframe and control 5. And paste it on here. Now move your hit bonner down small like this. Select all your hands. And this. Select this and copy and paste it here. On frame 28 select everything again like this. Up small. Select the leg and shift control by C and paste it. This one here. Let's move this one backwards like. Let's select this one and move it up a little bit. Now let's preview our animation and see. Returner and View. Now you are done your animation. Thank you for watching. See you in next video guys. Please like and subscribe for more videos.